off old things. I mean, it's just kind of the way it goes in that world, and you just accepting how it goes. Lotto, like, what, what do you think about it? Well, I mean, at that level, man, you're you're still talking. Um, I mean, these are kids, man. Yeah, and and they're still dependent on their parents. So to let a kid be a kid his senior year and then his freshman year now is grown folks business and he's still 17, 18, I just that just ain't right. You know. That's a lot to impose on. Yeah, it's a whole that's a lot. And and, and although a, a lot of us that were being recruited went through a lot of this stuff and yeah, it's it's, it's fun and, and it's a lot of good stories to tell. But no, it's not grown folks business, man. They they uh Definitely doing wrong. 301-429-9247. I'm going to take a moment and read some of the feedback uh, that we got online. And uh, we were talking about Michigan a little bit earlier and some of what's going on and how much money they made and kind of, and, and it's really kind of indicative of things that's going on in big-time big college sports, especially basketball and football. Now the question becomes, you know, since it is, then it's really not an amateur operation. It's a it's a big business. Yeah, it's not amateur. Man. It, it hasn't been, it hasn't been amateur for decades, but um, the way it's been, you know, with social media has brought almost everything to the forefront. Mm. So now that so much can be told so quick and and be responded upon even quicker. You know, it's like, okay, y'all are really, you know, this, this is, college is, to me, for the white players and the black players, it's slavery. You know, it's almost putting them back in the slave days, man, because they, they, these dudes should be getting paid. And the females for the, uh, when you look at the basketball, female basketball. Yeah, and it comes, and it comes to this coach time, I still, yeah. I still don't agree. Oh, no, when it, well, okay, when it comes to March Madness, yeah. then you can look at it yeah. and see. Right. You know, or any of the term, even the CIAA, uh, the CIAA tournament. Right. You just, know, it's, it's ridiculous, man. I just like starting stuff. Yeah, but well, they all should be paid. I'm, I'm, I'm telling you. No, I mean, I, you know, I, 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 the fact of the matter is that there's enough revenue coming in. It is. And then what happens is it takes some of the pressure off of the people that's involved with it to have to figure out how to balance this thing out because, well, you know what? I'm not going to talk about what it does because I have opinions. I don't want. My opinion the only one heard. Coach Tanya, welcome to the show. Hey. How are you? I'm tired, but I'm, I'm here. here. You're tired and here? Yes. All right, so we're going to make sure we put a big old cookie in your cookie jar for being <laughs> here. But you look. You, I don't know, dang, I don't know how to say that. Say it again. Snickerdoodle. You still eat those? Yeah. I eat those when I was like three. Snickerdoodles are good from the great cookie. From the great cookie? Mm -hmm. Oh, like that place in the mall? Yes. That's that all sugar. That's that all sugar cookie, right? Yeah. See, my, my 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 personal trainer here got me off of that kind of stuff. Man, I don't, I don't get to do snickerdoodles no more, man. I gotta eat stuff like oranges. But you, yeah, yeah. I get you a big old snickerdoodle. Is it like a real big cookie? It doesn't have to be a real big. One. I can take a little. Take a little snickerdoodle. Mm -hmm. I can take a little. Okay. <laughs> so you uh, so you a little tired today? Well, I thank you for coming. Mm -hmm. And I got you started early. I got you on the clock. And we got a chef. I know. Didn't that bust your bubble? <laughs> you was ready to cry. Ah-ha. You were on Ah-ha. Uh-huh. Yeah, busted your bubble. Folks, I got a phone call coming in Coast Tanya. So get ready for this party. Make sure you plug into the Louisville stuff, Coast Tanya, so we can get up-to-date stuff. This is Rolling Bubba Grimes. He on Rolling Grimes Show, Beauty and the Beast with Coach Tanya. Who am I speaking to?